and the masters of the universe. I am Adam, Prince of Eternia and defender of the secrets of Castle Grayskull. This is Cringer, my fearless friend. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me the day I held aloft my magic sword and said, By the power of Grayskull! became the mighty battle cat and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Only three others share this secret. Our friends, the Sorceress, Man-at-Arms, and Orko. Together we defend Castle Grayskull from the evil forces of Skeletor. It will be, Skeletor. That I promise you. The marble is here. Huh? <laughs> You're right, Orko. The hand is quicker than the eye. How'd you do that? Uh, 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 we magicians never reveal our secrets. So, just what is it that this new invention of yours will do, Duncan? My weather-controlling satellite will make us masters of the seasons, Your Majesty. It can turn a cloudy sky to clear. Then proceed, by all means. It works! Duncan! What's wrong? I don't know, Your Majesty. <laughs> Adam, my machine couldn't have made a storm like this. But I know of something that could. The Spellstone. The Spellstone? I thought it was only a legend. Oh, it's real enough. But to do this, it must have fallen into the hands of someone evil. I have an idea who that might be. Come on, Cringer. Oh, if it means danger, I'd rather stay right here, Adam. Adam? By the power of Grayskull! It's evil. 
soon all Eternia will be devastated, and I will reign supreme. You mean we, Skeletor? Only if you do your part right, Evelyn. A voice in the crowd can do more damage than even this storm. According to legend, the Spellstone is here in the region of flame. Skeletor must have broken into the temple of the Fire People. Who are the Fire People? A fierce tribe that doesn't like strangers. Oh, I, I have a feeling neither does he. Any ideas, He-Man? Just watch. Electricity works every time. Let's get to that temple before anything else happens. Sure, Taylor. Right, Father. Spellstone, do my bidding. Taylor. All right, Father. I just had the wind knocked out of me. Keep fighting the blaze. I'll be back. Our house. <laughs> It burned to the ground. Everything we had is gone, Father. The King's fault. And man-at-arms. What do you mean? Their inventions have angered the elders of Eternia. They have brought forth this storm. The only way to stop it is to punish those who are responsible. No. You must be mistaken. The woman is right. How can we save ourselves? We must act quickly, or the elders will destroy us all. In ancient times, what was the worst punishment? Oh, the creeping Horak. Oh. Father, do you know where it is? <laughs> yes. Then take me to it. Here's the temple, but where is the spellstone? Is this what you're looking for? Skeletor! Robots, attack! Skeletor, you make it too easy. Hey! <laughs> Just what I love! A great big toy! King Randor, you have strayed from the ways of the Eternian elders. That voice. I've heard it before. You have brought this curse upon us! It's Evil Lynn! We must save ourselves, and you must pay! Give me the creeping Horak! I... I beg you, don't use it. It's... it's too terrible. Don't believe her! She isn't what she seems! <laughs> will hold me? Oh, ah. Give me that! Creeping Horak will grow until it completely fills the palace! Creeping Horak. Long ago, it was used to punish criminals. They'd be locked in their houses. The Horak would grow over it until all the air was squeezed out. How oh, horrible. It, it'll even be, it'll be even more horrible if it happens to us. 
are nothing more than scrap metal, Skeletor. And as for you... Not so fast, He-Man! Behold! Tila! Gah! The king and queen! Look hard, heroes! Or it's the last time you will ever see them! <laughs> I think our friends could use a nice swim. against this. Ah, a dead end! Solid rock. But wait a minute. It's hollow. Boy, what I'd give for a trap door right now. If you can't find a trap door... Well, that takes care of the water. Now, how do we get out of here? <laughs> Talk about fast service. Finally, someone on our side. Oh, or maybe not. Let's see how this monster feels about fire. Tila, no! Run, Tila! I am Helios, king of the fire people. You have stolen the spellstone. No, you're mistaken. We're on your side. We want to find it and return it. Liar! Seize them! Try not to hurt them. They're not our enemies. I wish you'd tell them that. Whoa! Ah, there's nothing to you. But you 
You sure do pack a wallop. They've got to be kidding. What can you do? <sighs> Sorry, I asked. We're running out of rooms. Stand clear. There's no effect. It's not stopping it. Fall back. Oh, no! Fly, Orko! Fly! Tell me where you've hidden the spellstone. How can I make you understand we're friends? Fire people don't make friends with thieves. I won't fight you. That one nearly singed my tail feathers. Save me if you were evil. Go in peace, and may you find the spellstone. The last room in the palace. I built this hydraulic door to withstand anything. It's our last chance. Skeletor, but you won't get away with it. Who will stop me? Not you. How about me, Skeletor? He man. You blundering skull face! You said you'd taken care of him! And I will! Evelyn, the spellstone! Stratos, can you reach the spellstone? I'll try. This is all our fault. Then let's do something about it. No! A person doesn't need superpowers to be a hero. All he needs is bravery. You forgot that, Skeletor. You haven't won, He-Man. The only thing that can destroy the Hordak is the Spellstone, and I command it to return to the region of flame. Got to reach it. to escape. The creeping Horak, it's gone. And so a Skeletor, an evil limb. We'll meet up with them again. And what about the Spellstone? It's gone back to the fire people, where it belongs. Well, peace has returned to Eternia. 
The sky is clear and the birds are singing. The only thing missing is a rainbow. Let me handle that. You've all seen how Orko's magical tricks don't always go the way he planned. Sometimes they backfire on him. The same thing is true of practical jokes. Sometimes they don't go the way you planned, and you or someone else can get hurt. So be sure and think twice before playing a joke or a trick on anybody. It might not go the way you planned, and someone could wind up losing a finger or an arm or maybe even an eye. And no joke is worth that, is it? See you again soon.